this is the USB um, ATS TV stick. Uh, it's from K World. The unfortunately the came the packaging came fucked up because somehow it got fucked up. Um, basically, this is what it is. Is you stick you stick this uh, USB card is, and it acts like an antenna, and you can install a program and it acts like a television and you can watch television on your desktop or your laptop PC it's only for PC it's uh I'm pretty sure it's only for PC that's the magic of PC I'm not, I'm not hating on Mac but you could do prop other stuff with PC too but I'm pretty sure there's you could do all, all the stuff with Mac that PC cannot do but I'm just saying, I'm just fucking saying. Yeah, on the messed up box part, it says it's, it's Windows 7, Windows 8 ready. Doesn't say Mac. So, I'm gonna get it open. So, inside you have your the USB um, antenna or whatever you the plug. You also come, come it comes with um instant I guess USB USB. So you plug this USB there and you extend this is extension. Um this is your mic like mini mic mini antenna that you plug at the end of the stick. Oh, first things first. You it doesn't. It's, you cannot plug your cable in here. It, it doesn't work with cable. It doesn't work with a uh, Comcast. It doesn't work with anything that's a uh, second provider. It only works uh, with um, uh, antenna. It does not work with any digital digital television. So that's your first thing you must know. And comes with um, <coughs> a CD to install your stuff. <coughs> it's included Power Power Director 10, so that's your program to watch the television. You could also, I think, you could some somehow tweak it to watch it in your uh, Windows Media. So that's a bit more better, I think. It's, uh, so let's get to it. Cyberlink, uh, Cyberlink Power Director, Powerful Power for editing, limit of, okay, that's not what you want. That's Media Espresso, maybe uh, 6.5. Uh, auto runs with automatic install the program when you can double click auto run demo 3.2x ex to install it. No. <coughs> so this is it. It's, it's K World and. Uh, to say it's like yes, yeah, it's very, very. It's more bigger than your. <clears throat> the only thing I can compare it to is your SD card here. Maybe like one. Starting from the tip, like one, two, three. <clears throat> the, the width is the same, but the length is at least three times, at least three point four, three point five times of your SD card. <clears throat> so it's gonna be noticed when you stick it to your computer. It's gonna be hanging out like this. And I don't know what this plastic part is. Is it something I clipped out? No, that's just part of the design. <clears throat> and this here, you know, this you regular stupid little antenna but it's pretty cool looking it's very like I prefer this because it's more clean you don't have this big old freaking bunny ears I do have another antenna that I want to install more digital not digital but more um inferior than this uh, it's, I think it's by tech it's by Turk but I'll demonstrate that later when I'm trying to figure this out Okay, I'm gonna switch my camera to mobile. So let's um, and go through the process of me trying to figure this out and try to get television on my laptop. So.
Okay, welcome back. Okay, I'm on my mobile, so um, okay, I'm gonna say this again first. Don't get this if you're planning on using it to watch a, a television on your laptop or desktop using um, and using a cable or using Verizon or using Comcast or any any second-handed providing um, digital signal uh, network through cable through cable like the wiring. Nope. It only works for um, antenna using um, signals from the the air. So okay, after I I, I got that out of the way, um, I'm not gonna say that again no more time. So get it get it through your head. Okay. So let's see if it's uh, if it's um plug and play first. I'm just gonna plug this in, install no drivers, um, and see if it works that way. Um. I am I am on uh, Windows 7 professional but I'm not sure if it's professional ultimate uh, but Windows 7 is Windows 7 I'm on 64x so if that matters okay let's get to it so I'm just gonna plug this in and see right off the bat I don't need to drive install anything to get it working. I know I have to install the program, but maybe the window. I need a two-handed, so I plug that in. Device driver was not successfully installed. What a fucking dickhead. Mother you, mother you. So it didn't install anything. Let's see what it recognizes that. Doesn't recognize anything. I'm gonna get the antenna plugged in. Also, like this thing is too heavy and I told you it's lengthy before. It's like three it's like three point five of your SD card in terms of width. I mean terms of length. So this thing is like heavy and dangling, so you need something to support at least while you when you're watching because this thing looks like it's gonna just timber and just bend in the USB is gonna the the USB um the USB the stick, the shaft, <laughs> the shaft, it looks like it's gonna kind of bend or break, so you need to add support there. <clears throat> like I said, didn't install anything. Let's just try opening our uh, window media center and see if it's, you could work there. I know it's not gonna work, but just try. The best way to experience TV on your television continue. Welcome to Windows Media with Santa with Express 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 Express. Television live television setup. Live television setup. Set up your internet connection. Setting up your TV signal cards are Working internet connection. Next, begin to configure your internet connection. Huh. What the fuck? Do I really need an internet connection? I'm not plugged in, or I didn't, I'm not connected to the internet. I just gotta say thanks. If your intent to is for a cable modem, no, 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 similar mode, but it's likely that your connection is always on. Do you have an internet connection? I'm gonna say. What the f wait, the thing I don't get is If I do go internet connection, is it installing something that I already have on my, lap on my laptop? Cause my laptop does have a TV option And I don't, I, I don't want to install that because I want to install what I just bought And for other people that doesn't have my laptop 
It's not gonna stay no. The media is now able to locate a computer internet and then you continue to later in the setting. Next. The TV thing that cannot be uh, configured because the TV tunnel was not detected. If you have a TV turner, ensure it is installed correctly to find out what to watch TV on your visit. No, 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 no. So I have to install the driver of this shenanigan. So that part didn't work. It's not a plug and play, or just in my case, it's not. So let's install the. The K World Express. <clears throat> drivers and utility that it came with so I went to their site their main uh, main uh, K-World site and then found my product and I downloaded I found the driver and I downloading and installing right now I'll provide a link below on this exact uh, location of the site so I downloaded that driver and I setting it up now so I'll go through it with you. And so I'm gonna install it in my program file. Click install. Uh, press start to install. Press start. It's installing. I hope it installs correctly, or I mean, like uh, smoothly. So I don't need to fracking fix anything. Blah 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 install. The driver has been installed on your computer successfully. You press OK, you press finish, and the yada yada yada. I hope it's done. Okay, let's get off internet. I'm gonna sign off internet. Open media. Actually, I'm gonna stick this off and stick it back in. I stuck it back in. It doesn't look like anything is gonna pop out. Any program I'm talking about? Okay, so let's go back to Window Media again. I'm off internet. I'm, I'm signed off internet because I don't want to make it bother with my. Like I said, my. My um, laptop has a TV turner already, whatever feature. So I don't want. I want. I wanted to use the freaking stick. So I'm off internet. Okay, let's go. TV live. Set up your internet connection. I go whatever. No, I go no. No internet. No. No. Wait, wait a minute. Your region is used to configure your computer for your local TV service. Yes, use this region to be fuck. I'll type my zip code. I go, I agree. It's installing Microsoft Play Ready PC Runtime U EULA. What the fuck is this? Just fucking install this shit. Install an error was encountered while using installing Play Ready. You will not be able to watch watch pro record premium channel. To be tried this one, later. Shut the fuck up. Downloadable guide now available. Download TV guide listing is now available because the information is not set up. You may be able to get the listing from the TV available. Shut the hell up. I'm going to be your center examining your TV string. This process may take several minutes. Uh, it says Window Media then has detected the following digital antenna AT. It detected AT. TSC 
So ATSC one Turner. That means the Turner is working. That means you install the correct driver, and you're good to go. So ba ba ba. Other Turners on T using will detect the bug. Now configure configure configure. So I do have a televisions. I do have a, like I said. I do have a TV Turner in the in the laptop. I didn't really need this, but I want. I uh, I didn't want to use the laptop. Turner, so the so other turners were detected, so don't mind that. Is this the correct? Is this the configuration correct and complete? So yes, correct configuration with this result. So you press next. It says TV signal configuration file. TV signal will be configured to Windows Media Center digital digital antenna ATSC. So that's. That that's very good. So you press next, and then I think we should be able to watch now. It's scanning. That's good sign. This is red. I think the one flaw is this thing that's dangling. If you have a high laptop or low laptop, it still doesn't matter. The shaft of the thing is gonna crack. So you need some kind of support there. Um, maybe just get like a. Get like a sack of box of cards to get this. See that thing is just dangling. <clears throat> you want to put something there for support. It's scanning right now. I'll scan more later when I put the other antenna. Right now I'm looking for something to support that dangle. That's too tall. I'm gonna use the box that I came with and make a... I'm gonna make something with this. So that's it helping, right? Yeah. Yeah. So over there, uh, it detected nine channels found. High on cube. Cubo. I on life shop. What the fuck is that? Just detect freaking like your local channels and shit. I don't fucking know what the hell is that shit. You know, it detecting like backwards. Plus, I like to take like CBS, NBC, Fox, or uh, UPN, shit like that. <clears throat> the wind is freaking howling. I don't think this this camera is gonna detect the wind sound. I'm not gonna use the antenna that's gonna come here, but this is the antenna. It's like um, the length is pretty pr probably long enough. Not long, long enough, but long enough. Oh shit! That's what. It, that, oh wait, I just noticed. That's why it came with this extension, so it doesn't dangle like that. Oh, doof, doof. Okay, I'm gonna use this extension. So you plug this extension. It's gonna wire down, and you put that on on the on the bottom on the floor. And then, oof, doof. Oh, I'm so still bad. So that's why I came with this extension, and we plug that into the computer, and then you get, you plug that white thing in here, and then you don't need to use that shit, and don't, don't need to worry about that shit, like the shaft being destroyed. It's still detecting.
It detected 17 channels, but if you have a better um, antenna, on on air antenna, not digital television. Oh shit, I mentioned it again. It detected as CBS HD. Also detected. What the fuck? Detected Showtime. That makes no sense. A oh, shot time. Showtime. What? How the fuck did it detect Showtime? That makes no sense. That means I get free jail time. That makes no sense. This, that's the mystery. Let's see if it's show time. <laughs> Let's see if it's show time. Is that if that's the real show time? Show time. Remember, I'm not on internet connection right now, so it's, this is totally off air. So I think the scanning is finished. Let's see. I got stars. What? I thought it's just like on the air television, not digital. But it's just it's cannot be. I, I didn't know this. So let's see if this is showtime. So how do I press next? You have finished completing the middle of the final video. Did you type the turn one and click finish? And then you go live television, I guess. The fuck data from what? There is nothing no detected for this channel, the, the temporary affair, try again. So stupid, fuck you. I don't know what I did there. Okay, that's your channel 5. The real thing is showtime, okay? So the, your local television is working, and you just gotta get the antenna right to make it not lag. But then let's see that showtime. The fuck is that? I didn't know showtime. Uh, this is showtime, no data. No data available. I'm pretty sure that you cannot get showtime. Or stars. Actually, I'm gonna hook up my better antenna and see if I get it. So that's my that's the second test. Task. Motherfucker doesn't pick up channel four. And that's so stupid. Fucking stupid. Imagine this or this without using too much. So, okay, I, this is the way that I did it with um, Media Center. I'm pretty sure that I could use their program that it came with. Um, it's probably going to be called... It said on the box, in the beginning. Uh, let's go again at the box. What they use is... Total media. What they use is total media. That's their program that you probably should should uh, fidget with if you don't like media center. So total media looks cool too. So this video is gonna be like freaking forty minutes long. I'm gonna experiment with my better antenna and experiment with maybe total media if I feel more if I have time so also I'm gonna use the extension so you don't need to MacGyver this thing to not break the shaft and this is your, I'm using, so this is your final, 
demonstration of media window media center okay so i'm signing off okay i got my setup already installed the uh, first things first um the um, total media software is not uh, free so it's, you could get 15 you could try your 15 trial 15 day trial version or you could purchase for maybe 79.99 i think that's the license version so i'm not gonna do the total media install that so i'm just gonna use window media center and i got my better antenna here set up and i got the usb uh, extension set up to the thing so you don't you don't need to worry about breaking the shaft so let's get this is my this is, this is my final demonstration i'm gonna demonstrate if i get better reception with a better antenna so let's do it here do you want to add that stuff gadget to ssd no so let's do live television um i don't know if it's you have to scan it again or Okay, I think you gotta scan it again. Already uh, I uh, set up the scan and then I scanned it with my new antenna to see if we get better reception with a better antenna. Okay. I guess not. I guess this antenna is like broken or it doesn't work with this stupid target antenna. Your fucking antenna need no fault. The fuck is this? Well, God damn it. Obviously that piece of shit is overpriced and it's a piece of shit. It doesn't work with this or either that's broken. Something's wrong. So I went back with the new antenna. I mean not the new antenna, the, the given antenna. Which is this little bootleg motherfucker. It looks like a little 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 pee pee. A little crap. And then it's getting kinda of more better signal. Signal than that crap. That freaking crap. Is something wrong with that or something it's not working with this <clears throat> so if you have better if you have a much more better um antenna i guess you get you get more better reception but right now i only have that actually i do have another fucking but i don't want to try it no more <clears throat> i mean i don't want to freaking make this video more extent so i used that i used was given the the little little tiny antenna I'm using that, and you get the strength. You never get full strength. You get like at least all the way to four bar, four bars out of six. That's your that's your fullest. And and I still don't know showtime. Okay, <clears throat> let's them this this uh, showtime has four bars. If that doesn't work, if it doesn't come on, that means you don't, you don't get your time. <clears throat> and you're not supposed to get your time. So I'm gonna demonstrate and debunk the short time theory after I finish this scan. An exodus, ex exos, 
x zeros has green has five bars and I think we're done here okay and I think the video is pretty done too okay oh okay. Marijuana is on the bound. Wait. Wait a minute. Alright, let's go back. I have television. <clears throat> so this is it. So if you watch my video and you got this, I'm gonna save you the trouble. Um uh, I said it before, I'm not gonna mention it, but I'll mention it again. It does not work with your T uh, satellite, um, Time Warner, not Time Warner, your cable, digital cable. It doesn't work with the cable box. It does not work with Verizon, uh, any second t television provider. So it only works with on-air signal with your antenna. I have a freaking overpriced antenna. That shit doesn't work with this. I don't know why. It works with your antenna that comes with the box. It also it heats. It's, it's very warm now. Um, when it's working, it's red. You use the extension because you don't want to break the shaft. Um, download the driver. Uh, once you plug in to Windows 7, Windows 8, maybe Windows 8 might install it for you but Windows 7 doesn't install anything when you plug it in so you gotta manually install the driver the link of the driver I will provide under on the description also also the what was the program also the program um, airsoft total media software is it's not free it's 15 trial 15 day trial version for free um License per, license version is I think seventy nine ninety nine. Uh, you could use the window media center like how I did. How this whole video was about it, <clears throat> and um, that's about what I could tell you. And to get to the final conclusion, let's see if the Showtime is viewable. Showtime had four bars. Let's find it. I'm pretty sure you cannot find it. It's descript inscripted signal. So debunk it. Let's go to short show time. It has four bars. So this inscripted. The current is yeah, it says right there. The current service is inscripted and cannot be viewed at this time. So that's your debunk. So don't get excited when you scan and you, when you scan it and you scan HBO, you scan Showtime, you scan Stars, because that's inscripted. So there's a hell of a lot of long video. I hope I told you something that you didn't know and and have a good and then be um and make a good decision with this video. Um. I got this just because I wanted more room in my room, more space. I got rid of my my my, my um, HT television, and it looks more cleaner. Um, I just got it for to watch um, sports. I don't watch television as much, and I have cable in the living room. And this is your what is this? Your K World. Your K World USB ATS C TV stick, and that's your very thorough demonstration and unboxing. So goodbye for now and bye bye. And the best thing about this is it's compatible and it's super 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 storagey. Storagey, super super storagey, super clean. Look at this, I'm done. I don't have a tele. I don't have a big ass massive, massive thing to watch. If I want to watch news or if I just want to watch something. If you don't need television and you just need it for like Olympics or like sports events and news, 
Oh, Miss Gunn, all you need is a laptop. There's no big old freaking thing in your in your bedroom. And boom. Super compact, super light, super storage.